Hello guys, SilverPlayer22 here, bringing you another informed Silver Player review. Today we're going to be looking at Fedor Smolov, who is the six foot two Russian player from FC Kranznador. I think that's how you pronounce it. If it's not, I apologise. I, I do need to need. Oh, I do need to apologise because I actually did all this in-game footage and everything yesterday. Um, and then I sold the player on because I thought I'm not keeping him, you know, while he's so expensive. I'll buy him back at a later date if I want to. Um, but unfortunately, my footage corrupted. Uh, only on the uh, this this page that you've seen here and the um, and the uh, the next uh, the in-game stats. So I've had to wait until today because there was just none on the market. So I've sniped one specifically just so I could do these first this sort of this first minute of. Uh, of footage for the video so I hope you guys appreciate it <laughs> uh, anyway this guy has 86 pace 80 shooting 65 passing 77 dribbling 75 physical he's six foot two as I say and he's got three start three start on weak foot and skill moves anyway this guy has a relatively all-round in-game stats I would say he's got 87 acceleration 86 sprint speed, so fairly well-rounded on both. Decent strength, 83 finishing, you know, not bad long shots, decent enough shot power. Fairly good uh, volleys, surprisingly, because most silver players don't seem to have decent volleys. And as I say, he's uh, he's got three stars, three star, and he is right-footed. Anyway, let's get straight into this, okay? So, obviously, this guy looks like he's going to be probably one of the best silvers available in-game. I've, I've heard people, and I've seen people on Foothead, uh, comparing him to a sort of old-style Ebra, where he's tall, He's, you know, he's fairly nimble, he's strong, he's fast, he's got good finishing. Um, and unfortunately, I'd, I just don't see that. I, you know, on card and in-game, this guy looks pretty solid. I would say, although the clips are probably going to glamorise him a little bit here, because they're going to, I'm gonna, you know, the fairly decent power in his shots, that's what I would say. And, and fairly, not horrendous long shots, just sort of average. But his finishing was just so inconsistent, like... I felt like for someone who has 80 shooting on card, I really felt like, you know, and as someone who cost me like 100k, it really should be a little bit more, you know, a little bit more efficient at getting the ball in the back of the net. Heading wise, he wasn't the best. Um, strength wise, I would say he was okay. Yeah, no, fairly solid strength. And yeah, very, he did feel very quick. Anyway, let's have a look at his positives and negatives. He. Uh, as I said before, his long shots weren't great. It was passing. Oh, man, I felt like his passing was so off. Like, he just, like, wherever I'd pass it to, it seemed to just fly off in another direction. Um, his heading, as I say, wasn't it wasn't great either, considering he's 6'2". Um, but he did have, you know, relatively good dribbling, good balance, etc. I think he feels like a sort of 73 to a 76. I've given him a 7.7 .7 out of 10, which is probably going to be a lot lower than a lot of people who review this guy, because a lot of people will look at the card and think, oh, this is a god. People want people, you know, people want him to be amazing, so I'll give him a higher score. But I just, I'm very honest with these reviews. I'll tell you what they feel like. I wanted this guy to be good, but he just wasn't quite as good as I thought he would be. Anyway, guys, just before we move on, um, I have a new series choice for you. You've got a few options, either option one, which is silver pack progression, which is where I'll start with a really basic silver team, open a pack every episode and work my way through, you know, you know, making the team better. Option two is some top 10 silvers of all time, you know, top 10 sprint speed, top 10 passing, etc. And option three is just some cheap silver squads from around the world, um, you know, different leagues, etc. You know, maybe a 5k, a 3k, a 10k squad, etc. Um, the only other, you know, the only other thing to mention is I am still going ahead with my national squads and um, that's regardless of the new series that's gonna you know I'm, I'm looking to have a different a few different things going on at once anyway guys like subscribe and tell me what you thought cheers